y'all. So, I don't know what it is. I don't see string beans no more. You know, this is Revere Sky, Revere Sky's Essence. String beans, you used to pull it and the string come off. I ain't seen, oh, that look, that one like that. These just green beans, uh. Y'all know something? Don't never say a man fine or sexy. Let me tell you about this energy. Let's say you look at somebody too many motherfucking times, okay? It could be social media, it could be anything. And you just say, ooh, they fine. Let me tell you about this. Do you know you will attract that energy, that type of person into your life, the way they look? The exact same image, like doppelganger. And then it won't just be one. The universe going to send you a whole bunch of varieties of the same exact everything. They gonna all have a little bit of different mentality and stuff. They all gonna have different jobs and careers. But if you say, damn, that person fine, sexy, ooh, that person, you know, useful and stuff, child. The universe going to say, say no more. The universe is going to send you a plethora of that body build, that skin tone, that look, everything. Swear to God. Now, you just got to decipher which one <laughs> is um, on your Richter scale, your mentality. Yeah, don't sit up there and then don't masturbate to a vision of a person. And then the universe, shown up, start dropping them out the sky. <laughs> Ooh. Man, the universe will send you, you start fantasizing and, um, and, uh, Making, uh, you know, you start your libido and stuff start rising. The universe will send people that look and resemble that person, energy and everything. That'd be like, um, you like certain cars or something. And you, you want to be around that type of car energy. Like, you could be a part of the, um, that one just bad. You could be a part of the um, Hellcat Society. The universe is either going to help you get a Hellcat, motivate you to be around, to guide you to a situation where the Hellcat Society start coming into your life. You might even get one. You might get something similar. You might get something downgraded, but you in that sporty car society or high class car society, you know start being around that type of energy. You start you might even be around a person who let you borrow their car, you know what I mean? It's just like you want a garden or something, you'll start being around people that garden. Or you'll motivate other people to start garden. So you won't have to go out there looking. But boy, don't never say a person fine and sexy. Cause the universe gonna say, you know what? You know that person is taken. But we're gonna help you out. We need you to be aroused and on your P's and Q's. We need you to be wanting and using some of that libido, some of that energy. That energy shouldn't go to waste while you're on the planet. So we're going to send some stuff out there your way. To the potatoes. Yes. Green beans and potatoes. I'm going I'm to blanch them. Then stir fry them. I haven't been eating too much garlic, but I'm going to stir fry them with uh, shallots, onions, and a few cloves of garlic, and uh, grapeseed oil, and I might do a, I'm trying to figure out which herb I'm going to use. I think I'm going to use um, thyme, because I've been using a lot of rosemary. Yeah, I'm going to blanch them. 
and then stir fry them. I was going to boil them like old folks do. Boil them in the pot with the potatoes and they be real cooked. That's very flavorful, but now I want the green beans to be cooked just right. But yeah, honey, you want a certain speed around you? Or a certain type of breed around you? The universe definitely says, say no more. So you don't have to get that end off. That's the soft end. You just, see this, some of them are broke, so I get that little bad nub off. Now, if we was family child, we'd be eating all these. We wouldn't be popping nothing unless it was rotten. That, that dry scab over, nothing's really wrong with that. But if I had my own restaurant, I would have to cut that off. Like you, you wouldn't, you want them to look as fresh as possible. But um, since it's just me all the time, sometimes it could be a little bit wasteful. But let us be in a famine situation. Oh, this going in the pot. The stem and all, that's fiber. That's fiber. Like dry them out, powder it up. Shoot. So some of these don't even have the stem on them. They just got that little dry scab over edge. And um, I just want to pop it open to be fresh. Mm -hmm. So yeah, find what you desire. You don't even have to put it on the wall or nothing. You you get some arousal. You start percolating a little bit. And your spirit wants you to have somebody in your life. They'll just start dropping out the sky. If I send you the photos, right, of these five matchmaking people that all look alike, you'll be like, ain't no way. Ain't no way they all look alike. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. I don't know what to say. Don't, don't never get aroused while looking at somebody because the universe is going to send you multiple varieties. Now, I'm going to bring this water to a boil with the potatoes, right? With the potatoes in it. Bring it to a boil. And then I'm going to put the green beans in them. Let them blanch for like 10 minutes. Pull them out. I'm not going to put them on no ice water or nothing. Just going to have all the garlic and shallots ready. Uh, fricasseeing. Uh, sauteing them down. And uh, um, that juice just splatter. <laughs> Stem. I want them string beans. These are green beans. I want some string beans. I remember old school when my mama used to bring home a bushel. She used to bring home a bushel of string beans and make me sit in the kitchen after I do my homework. Or if I was avoiding doing homework or just act like I ain't had nothing to do, she'll put that bushel in there. I'll either be shelling peas or I would be stringing beans. We didn't too much buy green beans. We had string beans. That's right. But they could have genetically modified most of them or quit. But I'm sure if I go to a country town, they got some string beans. String beans got a string on them. And you have to pull it off because it's not edible. It's like a zipper. It's a zipper that zips up the bean. But I love shelling peas and stuff. It don't bother me. The, the one that's the most complicated is the garbanzo bean, the chickpea. It's in a little shell, and they're all single in one little shell. And you have to rub those shells, get them out of them shells while they're fresh and green. So there we have it. Under the magic, the truthful devil set you free. Visualize what you desire. The universe will bring it to you. The universe will bring flesh and blood to you quicker than financial gain. I've learned that. So, you know, because sometimes we need that companion, extra companion for love. Mm -hmm.